His journey is about opening our higher chakras and our root chakra to open multidimensional communication. To open the flow of support that is available to us. Support from above so we can feel safe in expressing our feminine and our masculine. I call in a rain of selenite crystal, brother. So as you're sitting or laying in your space, imagine that you're sitting somewhere in nature with the light and warmth of the sun shining down upon you, touching your skin. Really feel the wind caressing your skin, maybe the little hairs on your arms or your head moving. If there is grass or flowers or vegetation where you are, maybe seeing or knowing that the leaves are dancing under the wind and the green of the grass is shining with the light of the sun. As you get comfortable in your inner plane, in your inner space, I invite you to stand in your journey. Stand up and spread your legs in your imagination. And spread your arms with your palms facing up. Keep your hair and your head looking straight ahead and start noticing the rain of selenite coming down upon your body, upon your energy field, cleansing, clearing everything from your chakras all the way out to your aura. Feeling this rain of selenite. Selenite is what we use to actually clear other crystals. It's so powerful. This selenite rain, allow it to start clearing all your little channels, every part of your auric field, so that you may get ready for higher communications. You might hear the sound of rain in your imagination, or you might pretend that you can actually feel what it feels like to have this selenite rain showering your whole auric field. And we thank the selenite crystal as the shower stops. And I invite you to start walking on a path. This path is a golden path. This path will take you to a space where you're going to be invited to open even more. 
as you open your senses, you realize that there are angels around you. And these angels are with you, guiding you, supporting you. You are sovereign. Walking on this path. I invite you to adorn yourself like a goddess, like a queen. What would it look like if you were dressed as a goddess, as a queen, as a king, as a god? Do that now. Maybe a scepter, maybe you're a superhero, maybe you have a light saber, maybe you have a crown with flowers, flowy clothes, maybe you have a cloak. Maybe you have special, special tools or objects. However, it looks like for you to be in your superpower. Walk on this path with certainty. If, even if you've never been certain of anything in your life, I invite you to own your power as a whole being right now. Walking down this path with the knowingness that you're doing everything right and at the right moment, at the right time, the right space. I call in Archangel Metatron, the Archangel of our stellar gateway chakra. The chakra that's above the soul star chakra. This is how we receive multidimensional celestial guidance. Know that Archangel Metatron is here to support you as I call in the three fifth dimensional rays, the crystal three beautiful transmutation rays, the golden ray, the silver ray, and the violet ray. Violet flame. Feel these completely enveloping your body, your auras, your chakras, your organs, your cells, your DNA. Just allowing this to happen. You don't have to do anything. Standing there in your power in wholeness. Ah. Hey, I now call on Archangel Metatron to open his energy field and activate your stellar gateway chakra. So bring your attention maybe a foot above your head and feel a column of pure white light going from a foot above your head all the way down to your crown chakra. You might feel some pressure 
on your crown chakra, you might feel that there's something happening or you might feel nothing, but there's a crown opening that's happening now and there's a soul star opening that's happening right now all the way up to your stellar gateway. Just allow this to happen. Ah. We are now going to call in your higher self. So right now, call on your most integrated imagination depiction of your higher self maybe it's an energy maybe it's has a body a shape a color a form bring your higher self into your awareness your higher self is always there for you to give you higher guidance to support you in your actions in your expressions ah. and now we're going to ask that your higher self start coming down through your stellar gateway, through this column of pure white light going down your soul star chakra, your crown chakra, allowing your higher self to come down to your heart. With the power of my intention, I ask that your heart chakra be made wide, open, available to receive the wisdom, the guidance, the love of your higher self right now. Allow your heart to open. You don't have to do anything. Any plans, you have to fix your heart, to work with your heart, to open your heart chakra, forget them. Just allow your higher self to come into your heart. And from that space of power, then allow your heart to open and receive all the love you've ever craved all the love spirit and the divine has for you all the love the universe has for you all the love your guides guardians allies benevolent light beings have for you all the love you have for you or all the love you can have for you at this time knowing that it's only going to get more and more and more and more and more and more opening up opening up soaking it in allowing your higher self's love to imbue your whole being so that your words, your actions, your expressions, your movements, everything that you are becomes love. Hey, uh,
allowing yourself to truly receive this high vibrational love. This is where we get challenged by the masculine. This is where we feel like, wait, I didn't do anything. What do I need to do to receive this? And the answer is you don't have to do anything. It's already yours. It has already happened. It's yours. It's yours. Allow yourself to really be turned on by all the love. I invite you to ask your higher self to give you an answer to a question that you have or maybe to give you a practice that will help you receive all the love that you crave in an integrated way where you can welcome your feminine in a relaxed way. You can welcome your masculine in a relaxed way. Ask your higher self to show you or teach you how you can actually receive love in a relaxed way without feeling like you have to do something to earn it. You don't have to earn it. It's yours. So do that now. I... to exercise the flow of abundance that we know we have in our lives. We are now going to share this love with the planet. So pretend or feel or know that there's a beam of pink energy coming from your heart going to the planet. Imagine the planet like you would see it from space, a beautiful blue planet with the waters and beam pink energy of unconditional love to the earth because you have so much love to give, starting with yourself. And now slowly close that beam of energy. And at this time, I invite you to just rest. Rest. Rest as you start coming back into your present space, your present moment really coming back with this feeling of abundant, overflowing love. Coming back, coming back, walking on this path 
as the queen, the god, the goddess coming back, walking with all this love overflowing around you, coming back, 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 back to where you first started and just sitting down with the warmth and light of the sun shining down upon you and knowing that you can always, always come back here anytime, anywhere, any way. Before you come back completely, I invite you to take a moment to feel in your sexual organs, your perineum, your yoni, your vagina. Is it relaxed? If it's not relaxed, allow your next breath to relax this part of you. to open up to your expression and creative powers from your masculine and your feminine. If you're a yogi, it might feel like doing a reverse mula bandha. If you're very creative, it might feel like opening your nether regions like a flower that blooms like petals opening letting your whole body relax if you're a man allowing your perineum to relax Calling in a constant flow stream of energy from the core of the earth entering the space that you just open so that you may feel supported in your feminine and your masculine. Calling in for manifestation in a relaxed, knowing way as you come back even more to your present moment maybe allowing your breaths to come in deeper as you feel this connection from above your stellar gateway down to your crown going down your central channel to your sexual organs, out your perineum, all the way to the core of the earth. And coming back in an arc of creation in an integrated, beautiful, whole, sacred, marriage within way. Allow yourself to come back even more, maybe wiggling your toes, wiggling your fingers, allowing small movements to start in your body whatever feels comfortable breathing deeper resting in the knowing 
And as you come back, take the time to note any practice, any answers, any ahas, or maybe just how you feel right now. Welcome back. I'm going to play some chimes and take the next few seconds to write down anything that you remember before it goes away. Taking another deep inhale. And exhale. Coming back even more as you write. Welcome back.